a huge success helping charities all because of help from our community. Jared Higashi with the Hawaii Lodging and Tourism Association joining us with more on the 37th annual charity walk. 37th annual. Yeah. Holy smoke. And it is, it is getting huge. It's definitely getting huge. Um, last year we had 14,000 walkers raise over $1.88 million. Uh -huh. Now, over the years, mm -hmm. um, you have raised a lot. Oh, it's, it's just an amazing amount. I'm really overwhelmed with pride at the, um, how much the hospitality industry really gets involved with our community and how much money we're, um, we raise year after yeah. year just to give back. So this started as, uh, way back when, this started as helping one charity, but it has really grown to help is it is it all of them now? Um, so it started in 1978, mm -hmm. um, and, it, and it did kind of um, centralize around helping one charity at a time. But now um, we've actually extended it, and we built this into a huge premier fundraising event for um, for the state of Hawaii. We actually, we actually helped over 200 charities. Oh. Lo so locally. pretty much any charity can sign up. Um, yeah, any 501c3 charity can sign up as okay. long as they um, yeah as long as they have a 501c3. And we're not talking about just one charity walk here. We're talking about three charity walks. Already had one on uh, the first one's Molo uh, Molokai. Which um, is the first one? Yes, actually. So there's six there's six walks. There's six um, walks. Six walks on six different three. islands. Six. Okay, gotcha. Um, we just had Lanai and Molokai's walk mm -hmm. um, this past weekend, and we actually look forward to Kauai. And um, Oahu is on May 16th, okay. and that would be, you know, um, the third Saturday of every May. And we actually have Hawaii Island and Maui Islands next wow. week. Wow. It doesn't seem like it keeps growing, but it keeps growing. All right, so let's <laughs> talk about the Oahu one, because you said there's some changes this year. Yes. So for Oahu, we're actually cutting down our route from uh, initially six miles down to four miles, getting okay. rid of two really hot and sweaty miles, and really making a fun walk. Okay, sounds good. Yeah. And then as far as, um, I, I mean... I'm not sure how long you've been involved in this, but really, I would imagine all the people that are involved, um, you get to see the benefits throughout the community. Oh, absolutely. It's um, it's a, it's an event that really gets the hospitality industry involved, and year after year, we just see that um, the monies that we that we that we're able to bring in and allocate just keeps growing. So it really shows how much our industry is um, thriving to put their best foot forward. Wow. That's yeah. a theme. It is a theme, Let's actually. Hear yeah. Let's hear the whole theme. <laughs> it's it's um, putting your best before forward. Makes sense Sipa. for your home, right? <laughs> it's uh, $27 million so far. Mm -hmm. Outstanding. Let's throw up some of the graphics that we have because uh, we had a couple of the walks already, but there's plenty more to come. As we mentioned, um, there's Saturday on the Big Island, also on Oahu on May 16th, and the Oahu Venta. Some slight changes there, as you mentioned, starting at 7 a.m. over at Alamona Beach Park. Helping so many people in our community. Absolutely. Jared, thank you so much for letting people know about this in case All they right. didn't know. Time to sign up.